This morning in our Where's Marty segment, we're taking you behind the scenes at a very popular brewery. Yes, Marty joins us live once again. I have a guest, Marty. You're standing in front of Hops. Lynn Bowie? Ding, 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 ding. <laughs> winner, winner, chicken dinner. Lynn just said these are our hops. Very good. And that's, and that's exactly what they are. We're going to get to them in just a second. Sandy and Ray Frank of Inverness Brewing, uh, a farm brewery, which has become really, really popular. We were just at a pharmacy. There's Inverness. There's Big Truck. Yeah, Big, big, big truck, truck is huge. Yep. And uh, what's the other one you were mentioning? Uh, oh, oh, there's so many. Yeah. Farms now growing crops and becoming great breweries. So you can't, th this is incredible. These are old pilings you got out of the water downtown? Correct. Okay. Correct. So then you have to string the hops up because otherwise they grow along the ground, but they're not a weed. No, no. No, and then you have to, when they're very small, they're very laborious. You have to train them because what they will do is they'll just do what this one's doing right here. You have to train them to go clockwise around. And then, as you can see, they'll just take off on their own. That's, that's crazy. You were telling me in the southern hemisphere they grow in, the, in an opposite direction. Correct. 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 So these grow, so the vines are growing clockwise around these ropes you have strung up. Yeah. And, and they'll, they'll do it on their own. Yeah. And in the One, summer, and then in the southern hemisphere, just like a toilet will flush the opposite direction. <laughs> these do. That is, that is, now do, do, well, I just don't throw like a, a huge international brewery. Do they grow their hops like this or did you sure. say this? Really? Oh, well, massive amounts, much closer. Not only 1,200 yeah. strings like we have. So when you started your farm brewery, did you realize it was going to be this agriculturally intense? Um, we, we did. I mean, we're, we, we know farms. I mean, I grew up a farmer. But um, this is very intense. This is, this is a, a lot of work. And but you, it's worth it. It's really worth it. And you've been doing this since 2018. What was the genesis moment when you looked at each other and said, let's, let's turn the farm and uh, a cash crop called beer. It was our, 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 truly our love for craft beer and combining farm with that and then also combining a place for our neighbors and community to get together we've and met so truly many good enjoy, people. enjoy the like people. Like you when you come out, you know, we were saying, hey, there's Marty Bass, look at that, we were special. You know? <laughs> <laughs> well, my dog, my dog loved coming out, that's for darn sure. <laughs> We're doing a lot of moving around. Uh, what we're going to do next half hour, we're going to go in and show the actual end result process. Uh, we have been to a couple wineries, a couple of uh, 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 microbreweries, a couple farm breweries, and it's always fascinating the amount of equipment it takes to get that nice, cool glass that Lynn Bowie and her, and her husband, Big Al, <laughs> like every once in a while on a hot weekend. And Lynn, I just read Sandy and Ray's mind. They're so impressed you knew these were hot. <laughs> Next time you come out here, the first round's on them. <laughs> okay, tell them Big Al likes it the hoppier the better. Big Al likes it the hoppier the better. <laughs> we got hoppy. <laughs> we, got, we got a lot of hoppy out here. You know what we're going to start calling Big Al? Heavy, you know, heavy gravity, Big Al. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> Thanks, Marty. We'll Does check back Alan know you. about his nickname? <laughs> he will now. Yes, he's probably just <laughs> thrilled. thrilled. <laughs> yes. well,